Hello there, I'm Vigalius. Good morning. I, I guess. I guess it is. It's a very British morning here. Um, it's dark, cold, raining. And just overall just awful, just terrible. So I guess that's a great way to describe my country. It's an awesome way. But I'm here with a cup of coffee in a mug um, that has a Stormtrooper on, but it looks like the, Star the <laughs> Starbucks logo. So these are all fun facts for you to to digest right now. Um, you may have noticed, by the way, I, I was going to talk about this the other day. There's a commentary I did yesterday, uh, completely off on tangents immediately. There's a, co a commentary I did yesterday where um, I, I said that I've been experimenting and I made a bunch of like step bro jokes and then I did explain why <laughs> I was I even said about experimenting but the reason I said about that is because you may have noticed that I'm trying things I've popped my intro and outro back in just to kind of create a more cohesive package now that I've made the very simplified commentaries I do want to put a bit of work into making them as as good as I can uh, while still using a very express and easy um, process to make them and I think an intro and outro is a good way to do that because I can just leave it in my timeline and then chuck footage over it. So uh, I'll, I'll go play around with these for a bit. They may not return. They may become a staple of uh, the videos, but it helps create overall cohesion. But there is something I want to talk about this morning. Um, updates aside, I've just realized I think that's Hassan Piker. But there's um, something that just popped up on my Twitter and I kind of... I don't want to talk about it. All right? <laughs> okay, so I don't really like talking about um, stuff that... Dexerto, uh, the I think it is on Twitter post. This is kind of driving me crazy because I've seen a cut a few posts like this. Um, this is a Twitch streamer who, how do we put this? Uh, Ample certainly has um, uh, big boobs. I guess is, <laughs> is probably the best way of saying it. Um, and is naked and like the, the just the the nipple is being cast off uh, by the screen and they're sort of like jiggling them around and interacting with the stream and that's the entire stream uh i have an issue with this i don't like this i don't think this is good i'm just gonna say it i have all respect for sex workers uh only fans models if, if that's what you want to do if that's what you choose to do for a living then fine um it's not my cup of tea purely because firstly i'm i'm, I'm not single and secondly because it just doesn't do anything for me like knowing that i paid for it doesn't do anything for me at all um but this uh i'm just not okay with it. i'm sorry like twitch is is very much um i don't, don't want to like go think of the children but let's let's be let's be real for a moment it is it's it is targeted at children and my knee-jerk reaction is to say uh i don't like to see sexualized content on a app that is mostly watched by children i i think if they showed that on cbb's uh, you know, <laughs> I don't think too many people will be happy about that. Um, and I understand that it's a natural part of, you know, of life that the, the body is a thing and it's something that we have. But at the same time, I think that creating an environment of it's okay to use your body to sexualize yourself uh, and invite that is a good thing to people who are, are a very impressionable time of their life and not particularly cognizant. I don't think it's a good idea to do that and spread that. And so to see this, you know, I just, I, my, my daughter, I, if, if, if I thought that she was taking this in and, you know, being like, oh, I can do this and I, I can garner attention by doing this or like, this looks great or, or whatever. I just don't know if I want that decision to be made for her at a time where she can't really make decisions, particularly with something as important as that, as, as important as using your body in a way that is, is you know, sexualized. I, he, I even saying that in a conversation like this, I don't like it. It makes me feel gross, you know. Um, again, I, I, I really do have all support for people who want to do that. That's great. But I think that decision should be made when you are more cognizant and creating an environment where this is approved and glorified um, is not okay. And so I don't I, I don't think it's okay that Twitch are allowing this. I also think that uh, I'm also not that shocked the floodgates are open. I mean, they've clearly shown a very lax policy on sexualized content on Twitch and now obviously people are going to uh, tease the doors i i don't entirely blame some of these people doing this i mean i do they really shouldn't be doing this and they should be thinking of the children but they should i mean they should you know as bad as it sounds um but i also 
I don't really blame them for like the, testing the floodgates and, and seeing what they can get away with. This happens with every form, you know, like every time uh, YouTube announce a new uh, slightly lax rule on copyright, people uh, take advantage of it and see what they can get away with, you know. It always happens with cryptocurrency. That was just one big stream of people seeing what they can get away with uh it, it will always happen and they should have known that a lot of people said this going in when um that woman who got fucked on stream um you know when that was okay and they okayed that people said this they said well this is going to open the floodgates people are going to try new things and, and see what they can get away with and that's exactly what happened you know and now we have this i'm not even going to get into the fact that it's very low effort and the fact that they're making a lot of money by essentially doing nothing i'm sorry but they are doing nothing i suppose they are it is sort of like the risk and confidence of putting your body online okay but again if that's the path that you want to head down which is great then you should be heading down the correct avenues with that the offer the correct amount of protection and you know age gating and stuff like that anyway it's a very serious conversation for the morning but it, it really did rattle me i'm not happy about it i'm not happy with the streamers doing this uh i don't think they should do it and i'm particularly very angry at uh, twitch for this i really don't think they should be allowing this um it's just not fair uh, i don't i don't think it's right i you know again this isn't a matter of like low effort stuff i've seen some you know not sexualized content that's phenomenally low effort so that's not what, what's annoying me uh, and i'm not complaining about some boobies you know that's fine by me but um i don't know maybe there should be like an 18 plus section on twitch or something like that where you have to verify your age because this is just getting out of hands <laughs> ridiculous right i'll see everyone later okay PlayStation is only $149, and you can also get leading titles.